Hey everyone, Lens Wenos and Chilled here for another episode of Manufacture Chew. How are you doing today, buddy? I'm doing all right, and yourself and everybody else? Um, my brain's a little taxed from what we've been trying to do. Yeah, it's a little confusing. This is the trial and error on how to learn the signals mod. Um, all right, so let me head back downstairs. So we've been mucking around with this, and I think we're pretty close. Um, but we've got. We've got two carts running on the line um, and got these nifty little network controllers and it's, you know, it's, it, the little carts are driving around and they're going to their destinations and hopefully it's working. Uh, so we've got a few, uh, this is the whole network on, on us, you know, on a plan basically, this little uh, rail network controller and you can see we've got this cart coming through here which will zip past us. Uh, it's going to get to that next trigger point and it should have been picking up right away um, it's already got some in it but I think the actual oops, this one should bypass there it goes so that one there's for ethanol the other one's for right away so the right away one should come into here and load up on right away but for some reason the right away is not it's not making it down haven't looked at that there's some up there I'm, I'm thinking that maybe there's some ethanol in this line Probably. Uh, let's put a tank here. Nothing. <laughs> there is nothing. <laughs> anyway. Um, so this this was a bypass. We were mucking around with different ways. So this pipe will go eventually. Uh, what's in here? Nothing. So yeah, we're just trying to fault find the last few little bits and pieces uh, that is required to get this system working. But the idea is that it it uh, picks up from one location and, and drops off in the, in the other one, and it's a separate a uh, a separate cart each. I'm not sure why it's not putting anything in. It's obviously something with the pipe work up there. It's definitely right away in that line. Unless the um, have you broken the loader and replaced it yet? Uh, um, I think I did. Can do it again if you like. I've got another one. Mm -hmm. Let's do it anyway. So again, it's kind of trial and error uh, with what we're doing. And yeah, we've obviously just got a bit of a bug with a pipe up here somewhere. But uh, yeah, the, the idea behind it, cart comes in, picks up the... Uh, the ethanol and delivers it back to the ethanol drop point which is that one down there uh, they will take the shortest route it's the right away fluid one they should take the shortest route um, so in this case here the uh, all of them should and this this needs to be tidied up a little bit more um, all of them should go straight because it's the shortest route and then if it needs to go to the, the drop it goes left. Uh, with the little controller thing here, the configurator, you can actually click on a cart as it comes past. Let's see if I can get this guy. Nope, missed him. <laughs> um, and you can set which station it needs to go to. Oop. Yep, he's gone past. Oh. Um, yeah, so the idea is you, you set their little um, there's schedule. I'm going to stand in front of one. It's easier. Stop the cart. Um, but yeah, once once you've set their their route, they will follow the line until they get to that spot. Let's, let's stand in front of a train. All right. So this one goes rad pickup and then to scrubber. And he's currently trying to get to rad pickup. Oop. And I don't think he's ever actually getting there, which is, I believe, maybe the problem. Maybe I need to move that rad pickup um, station. It's not actually arriving at the station. Maybe. No, it. Ow. The uh, the loader is not actually getting fluid from above. Oh, come back. <laughs> right. I guess I'll need to. I'll head up here and I'll try and figure out what's going on with this pipe work. Might end up breaking the pipes. Uh, we did have a an issue where it was pumping right away back up this line, which is unfortunate. Ah, here we go. I found the problem. 
It's not making any. Because this is full of right away. Okay, that's got ethanol in it now. We should be getting right away again. Maybe. Let me know. You're getting some down in there or it's already gone? Yeah, this is starting to come in. There's 125 in there now. 250. Cool. Yeah, we some uh, we had uh we've had to reconfigure the lines downstairs a few times and, and it was one where the Radaway came back up this ethanol line. Um so that should be fixed now. Fingers crossed. And we are producing Radaway again. Uh, these chemical plants have both been upgraded to tier twos to get them moving faster. And I'm hoping hoping that everything is all good. We've got 210 buckets of ethanol. The idea is that uh, we'll eventually hook these other scrubbers up as well once we get our brains around the network and how it's all meant to uh, do its job. Right, can't get can't get through that way. Did that pipe even go anywhere? Nope. There's nowhere. Okay. Is it meant to go here? Oh no, I think I broke that one. All right. Uh, so that should be working. It's a little dark down here. I'm hoping that it, it's filling up with right away. And then it should be depositing it. Oop, get out of the way of the carts. Let's run over here. It should be depositing it over in the station over here. Which will be delivering it to the network upstairs. So this is full. The other one, when it comes around here, should bypass. It should go left. No, right, I should say. Left from where we were looking at. And then if it needs to pick up ethanol, it'll pick up ethanol from here. Let's head up top. Just make sure this is actually working. I uh, need, need some space. Uh, you can have that and that. So if we, yep, so this is working, it's flowing through. If I close this valve, we should see ethanol is topping up into here. It's got two in it. But this is doing its job. I think it might be working, Chill. Although the ethanol tank does not come through the unloader station. Okay, maybe it's still trying to get to this station to do its pickup. And because there's nothing there to pick up, it's not doing its thing. Maybe. I put a bunch of ethanol over there in the scrubber. On 63 sure. ethanol in the fluid cart transfer. Um, it's just picked it up. Oh, hang on, this station's red. Maybe that's the problem. This one's green, this one's red. Why are you red? Yeah, ethanol just shot through the bypass. Didn't go to the unloader. Let's call this... Um... Grab one F. Just redo the. I don't know if it's meant to be here. Oops, that's not going to work. Don't do that. <laughs> uh, again, I'm 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 not sure. It, again, we are learning as we're sort of playing with it. I've watched a, a couple of videos oh, and there it went. There it went. It went through it. Okay, yep. so I just it I went just... through. It unloaded. I broke and replaced the station mark because it was red. Hopefully things are working again. This is this is what we've been spending the last, I don't know, hour or so on? Mm, about that. All right, so now I've got a, a station on the... Okay, so now we have... This one wants to go to red pickup. It should go straight. 
I think it goes to red pickup. Is red pickup red now? Because it hasn't triggered that it went to red pickup. Oh boy. <laughs> this I is see. The it's because I see. I see. If you're looking at the map, yeah. Uh, they change. We might need a second signal light so that it, it can. That way, it's not too close to the other uh, wagon. You know what I mean? It's Maybe. like they're triggering one up, one apart. Oops, that's not what I intended to do. <laughs> oh, the joys of the drill. Um... Making a mess now. Where'd the lever go? Oh, it's there. Stop looking, everyone. I found it. Can, can you go? Why? I don't know if that's fixed it, but it's worth a try. Yeah. Uh, again, we're, you know, trial and error. Fingers crossed things are happening, but. Um... This one wants to go straight. It's going to the scrubber. It should have been depositing at the scrubber. This one should go left to drop off ethanol and went straight through. Cool. Well, we went to the ethanol drop and it should bypass here. This one should go straight through here. You can see the little flicker of the yep. light as it as it goes through. And this one should come straight up to here. Yay. And it loaded the rat away. Nice. All right. Well, hopefully... This is working, and again, we just need to expand the network now mm -hmm. uh, to the where the other scrubbers are. A few more and, bypass stations. Yeah, a few more, a few more setups like this. Obviously, the other ones are all going to be similar to how our. It's not going to be the same as this because this is the bypass, because it's just the one drop off. The other ones will be more like this station over here, where we've got the two paths. And it'll choose which one it needs to go to for either so drop we'll off just, or pick up. And we can just run pipe work to this location from other scrubbers. Now you're going to cheat that way. <laughs> <laughs> well, only the you know only if they're close. You know, we can once I mean, we get we, spread out. Yeah, we may need to like have another one all the way down the other end of the base, and we'll just run the rail mm -hmm. down there. Exactly. And set this up. And, and then any of the scrubbers that are close enough down there, we'll hook them up then. Yep, works for me. But yeah, so this is our little little rail network, and hopefully it's going to do the job that it needs to do. Um, other than that, all fun and games, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, boy. Um, let me... I've got so much junk in my inventory now. Fluid routers and valves and tanks and... Alright, uh, I need to organise some more blue research. I wanted 100, didn't I? Let's just get another 64 of that requested. Uh, I did want to unlock the military blue or production science. or You know, we've got a few things we need to unlock. And, you know, to, to spur on our next piece of junk we're heading towards. Uh, Our next rabbit hole. That's it. Uh, production blue would be good. We need to unlock production blue so we can get to fabricators. Um, so production blue is all the way over here. Oofed. I oh, know that's purple research is a hundred blues. So maybe that's what we need. Purple research sound fine. Let's see that on military, and with the server on peaceful at the moment military is probably not the biggest issue hmm. um yeah once we get these scrubbers going we'll, we'll try it again but things keep breaking uh we're trying to tweak through the network a bit more you know and thank you for the suggestions of you know cleaning up some of the pipe work maybe our piping isn't the best in the world probably not right well, that's um, kind of. I think the high speed's taking care of most of it. 
Yeah, but we're still not getting things like sand and dirt heading to the shipping containers. Um, so if I look in the dirt one, it's only a third full. If we go up to the sand one, it's about half full, and there was a stack and a half of sand in the tree farm that should have come up here. Okay. So I've got an item sink, and I've got a provider. Um, I shouldn't need to do the supplier. I mean, I'll probably put an active supplier in here as well. But ideally, the item sink should be anywhere that, if it doesn't have somewhere to go, the sand should come here. I don't... Do I need to put item, a default route on here? I don't know if that's default route for sand. That may, that may cause some dramas. May cause some, <laughs> some rather large Mate. dramas. Let's try it. Let's just see if we can scare ourselves. If if dirt all of a sudden just flowed, flows in, then... Oh, boy. You're like... It's so much, so much learning to do here with all the mods that you know I've played with before and I've touched on before, but in a in a network like this, it's um, it's a whole different kettle of fish. But we, you know we're trying to rely on things to to produce quick enough that things happen, and it's not. Anyway, that's then them's the breaks, right? Let's put That's on. Minecraft. Let's put wire on here. I'm tired of it. This is dirt. Dirt. There we go. Infinite. It's unrouted. All right. Can anyone tell me why, when I throw an egg, it sounds digital? <laughs> I don't know whether that's meant to do that. Oh, okay, so it sounds it what? Uh, the noise I get from my resource pack is a little weird. <laughs> Some sort of, like, I don't know, beep sort of noise as you throw an egg. I don't know, maybe that's working again. Sand's now leaving. I don't know where the sand's going. It's going somewhere. And then it's coming back. <laughs> awesome. I love it. I don't know. I don't know. All right, let's see if our um. Actually, you know where the sand's probably going. It's probably getting moved off to make a sandstone, perhaps, or being crushed. Because um, I did just request all that stuff in the request for sixty-four blue signs. Well, we've got dirt coming in. Yeah, I just put the provider on the front. But to me, the item sink should work because it should just go there if there's nowhere else. So I'll probably end up moving that item sink out. Um, but the dirt does need to leave all these chests. We've got so much junk and irradiated things down here that um, it's not good. It's not good at all. Break everything. Break it all. Here you go, you want some... I don't, know, I don't have any basics on me, but that's all just going to make a big mess. Look at it go! Right, let's break that. Let's break this and this and put the provider on there and... Fine. So I did have things like speed, item speed. I had extractor. I had all sorts of stuff trying to empty this chest out. And it just wasn't doing what it needed to do. No, oh, it's getting it's getting items in it now. Anyway, that's yeah. cool. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Right, let's. You know what? We'll just take all these things. Excellent. So yeah, another step forward. Getting the right away moving around. This is now scrubbing the atmosphere for us. Hey, we're down to thirty-seven U rads instead of. Eight M's for <laughs> million. Um, but yeah, so obviously we just need to set up the other scrubbers around and, and help us help us in that respect. Um, obviously, this one over here will just pipe the ethanol straight into the ethanol oh, yeah. network. Um, and the Radaway 
drop off. I mean, we're right here. We could probably set up that bypass to be the, the right away drop off. Unless you don't want to deal with that. Um, I just want to run pipe. We could do a drop off there. That way it just pipes in. It's like this here. We can just run this pipe this way. Yeah, I was just going to pipe that into the... Yeah, something like that. That'll do. My element, just like that. And then, yeah, the right away into the... From down below, maybe. But I've still got a couple of... I've got a wagon transfer on me, if, if you don't. A what? I've got the wagon transfer thing. Oh, um... Don't have the room. <laughs> yeah, I do. Oh, okay. it just I mean, back up. and then we just need to do the the same thing. We'd have to put all the uh, bits and pieces in right underneath it. There we go. Whoop. It's pretty close to where we need it too. There you go. <laughs> we set it up in the, I guess, in the straight through path, which isn't amazing, but we'll just have to reconfigure this a little bit more than we already have. Um, all right. Let me dig a bit more of this piping up, and then I'll go and check whether our research is done. So yeah, we'll have to give it a station name and everything. Uh, what are we going to call this one? Scrub 2, watch your back. Bonk. <laughs> Take that. Yeah, I kind of wanted to block it. Um, so we just need to name this. Oh, yeah, that broke the station. Yes. Um, all right, so Scrubber 2 or something? Yeah. Scrub, yeah, Scrubber 2. Cool, and then we just need to tell the cart to go Scrubber 1, Scrubber 2. Scrubber 1 and then Scrubber 2, and then it should go back to Rad Pickup. It's trying to get to trying to get destination of rad pickup at the moment. Again, like, it, things are a little odd. I don't know if it needs to stop in front of the station or if it just needs to be within the block signal of the station. Oh, maybe that's the problem. Need another signal. Where you're standing. Maybe that'll work. We shall see. So either way, even if the Radaway one comes through here, at least it's designed to, you know, do what it's meant mm -hmm. to. It's not like before where we were unloading Radaway into the ethanol. Right. Fingers crossed. <laughs> Fingers very crossed. I don't know where they are at the moment. Here comes one. Should be ethanol. Hey. You? Wow! <laughs> In my screen, that cart zipped through like it was... <laughs> it was crazy. I hope it works. I hope it actually does its pickup and it doesn't just keep getting lost like it's been doing. It picked up. It still wants to get a red pickup. That's the problem. 
it still thinks it's never been into the rad pickup um, station. Again, it'll be something to do with with this and and not. I don't know if this needs a. I don't know. We've put booster rails in front of it and it breaks it and. Yeah, I don't know. We'll play around with it a little bit more. It it, it should still do what it's meant to. It's just not. It's just going to be a little confused. Um, but it should still. If as long as we keep the default path being the one where the right away goes, we should be okay. And then it'll always try and get back to here. Either yeah, that'll be break it and start again. <laughs> we may need a second one on the right away path. Anyway, let's um let's jump back upstairs. Go and check on our uh Research, where's my, where's my way up there? Okay. Uh, ethanol might have run out already. <clears throat> yep. The ethanol flowing again from the uh, sugar cane here. Right, let's see if we can unlock this last science and see how much of a rabbit hole it is. Should have the hundred I need by now. Good. Let's get rid of them. Grab these couple of stacks of blue. Pop this open. I'm going purple research. Sound about right? Sounds good to me. Right. We go purple research is unlocked uses of purple research in a lab to make production blue and in an assembly machine this is where we need electric furnaces assembly machine twos and chemical plants so hopefully the chemical plant one i'll probably just end up making assembly machines for these because the the duplicator doesn't seem to do what i expect it to do but uh, this should help us. I'm going to maybe ask for some more blue research. Because keeping it, keeping it going, let's grab another 64 and kick the network off again. Watch everything start flowing around the pipes again. Watch the power drop to nil. <laughs> we'll get there. We'll, we'll make some more solar panel threes. Actually, we should probably have a stack in there now. They were auto crafting. Let's have a look. Solar. We have 63 solar panel threes. Sounds like a bonus. Any of these will disappear back in the network. Stone. Nope, stone went. Yeah, the, the default route chest is generally pretty full. But yeah, so there's there's our next thing. So I guess that's uh, next uh, bit of in-between episode stuff will be us getting the, the crafting up to get the next science. And then I can maybe drop a third lap down for these researchers. We might be able to use that one. I'm not, I'm not sure yet. Um, but yeah, so making use of purple research we're going to need purple science packs which is electric furnace assembly machine 2 and chemical plant so we'll get these three guys crafting and start making the purple science uh, so that, you know we're going to need quite a number of items uh, let's see none of it's really terrible though so we'll, we'll get these things crafted up and then hopefully we'll be able to start unlocking some of the uh, the purple science, production blue science, I think it's called. Uh, let's see. Which will be fabricators. It's 50. We'll be able to get fabricators going uh, instead of assemblers, which will be nice. Um, we still need to unlock all these modules and then get into the productivity ones. Uh, what else we got? It's nothing really in logistics except, you know what? Do you want some translocators? Sure. Might be nice. 
There we go. Translocators are unlocked. That was probably stuff thrown everywhere there. Yeah, I picked up half of it. Oh, the solar panels. I think you got my uh, my plan. Yeah, I did. Um, but that's alright. Put the purple research in here for the moment. Uh, so yeah, we now can make translocators. That'll be nice. It'll help instead of um, using inserters for some stuff. Where are they? Get those solars. Oh uh, yeah. There you go. Probably come back to me. Yep. <laughs> Uh, item translocators. Oh my gosh, have a look at how they're crafted. <laughs> translocators. So, Ender Pearl, Circuit 4, Tungsten Plate, Cobalt Steel gold Gear, wire. and Gold Wire. Yeah. Nice. Thanks, Golroth, for the rabbit holes. <laughs> All right, well, I think that's an episode. Thank you, everyone, for watching and enjoying through our derps, I hope. Um, train network up and running. Hopefully the scrubbers will get some more scrubbers online shortly. I'd like to place one over near the uh, radiation production stuff. Oh, and definitely. We'll uh, hopefully be able to live in a world where there's mobs <laughs> that aren't trying to eat our face completely off. We have no power. Have a look at it. All these batteries are empty. Mm-hmm. Yep. Gotta love it. Nuclear might have to happen soon. All right. Thanks again. Comments below. I hope you enjoyed it. And we will see you next time. Have a good one, everybody. Bye, everyone.